Pataling Jaya MP Lee Chien Chung has offered a tongue-in-cheek congratulatory message to former Prime Minister Dr. Mahathir Mohamad. In a statement today, Lee said that it seems as if Mahathir has become the de facto leader of PN and congratulated him on the role. He highlighted PN Deputy Chairperson Ahmad Faisal Azumu's statement challenging Prime Minister Anwar Ibrahim to reveal his wealth and said that it was similar to the call by Mahathir, which shows that Bersatu is beginning to bow to the Grakan Tanah Ai chairperson. He also pointed out that past President Abdul Hadi Awang has signed Mahathir's Malay People's Proclamation. With this, he said it is clear that the influence of PAS and Bersatu is seen to be declining so that it is necessary for them to depend on Mahathir's strength. Lee also dismissed claims that Anwar had not disclosed his wealth, saying that he had declared his assets on November 9, 2022. Earlier this week, Mahathir asked Anwar to declare how much he was worth when he served as his deputy prime minister from 1993 to 1998, claiming the latter was among the past leaders accused of cronyism. This came after Anwar reiterated his call on Mahathir to reveal how much the nonagenarian and his family are worth. Meanwhile, Faisal told the Star today that GTA is unlikely to survive on its own as it is not a force to be reckoned with. He said Mahathir might be an influence, but the alliance was not like PN, which was a force on its own.